case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a 1975 case heard by the United States District Court for the Northern District of Georgia, Southern Concrete Services, Inc. sued Mableton Contractors, Inc. for breach of contract. The issue at hand was whether evidence of trade usage and prior understandings could be used to explain or supplement the terms of a written contract without contradicting its express terms. The plaintiff, a concrete seller, accused the defendant, a buyer, of failing to purchase the agreed-upon amount of concrete for a construction project. The contract in question explicitly outlined the quantity, price, and timeline of the concrete sale. The plaintiff sought to recover lost profits and expenses incurred due to the defendant's alleged breach of contract. In response, the defendant claimed that industry customs and additional terms not included in the contract should be considered, enabling them to renegotiate the concrete amount and price. Upon review, the court ruled that evidence of trade usage and additional terms could not be admitted if they contradicted the clear terms of a written contract. Furthermore, it declared that oral agreements or industry-wide customs challenging essential contract terms were inadmissible. Thus, the court emphasized the importance of parties assuming the binding nature of written contracts and the necessity of expressly agreeing to any modifications in writing. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.